Welcome to the heart of the home. I'm Chef John Maxwell, and we're here in Doswell, Virginia, at Meadow Hall, at Meadow Event Park, and we're getting ready to play with some great Virginia farm-raised mushrooms. These are beautiful, they're consistent, and they're available this time of year. So I've got a pot over here with some butter, just browning off the butter a little bit, right? That's done, I'm gonna add some onions. Well, some flour rather, I'm sorry. Okay, we're gonna add some onions. And we're gonna add some shallots. And we're gonna add some garlic. Now, I don't want these to brown off because I don't wanna give my chowder too much color. What we're doing here is making what's called a roux. Right, it's a French term for the butter and fat, I mean for the flour and fat, that will absorb the liquid and cause this to tighten up some. I'm going to add a little bit of vegetable stock. Now I use butter because I like the flavor of butter and I like what it does in here, but if you use the vegetable oil, this would be a good vegan dish because there's no uh, animal fats or animal products in it other than the butter. Again, I want this to come to a bit of a boil and start to thicken. All right, it's boiling. So I'm gonna add the mushrooms to this. Don't wanna overcook the mushrooms, want them to keep their shape, but we want them to soften up. So I got Nice good batch of mushrooms. I got shiitakes and I've got white forest mushrooms and brown forest mushrooms and creminis. All kinds of mushrooms in here. And you can use any kind of mushroom that you want. If you wanted, this soup works really good. Straight out with white button mushrooms. Okay. Now, I want to give this just a second for the mushrooms to spill off the water that they're going to spill off of. And then I'm going to add some more of the stock. And whenever I use butter, I like to add an acid to what I'm cooking so that we can cut some of that fat. And the acid that I'm gonna be using today is white wine. Just gonna add a, about a cup of white wine to this. And stir that around. And I'm gonna add some thyme, and a couple of bay leaves, a little bit of salt, now this is just going to simmer until the mushrooms are done, and then I'm going to add some milk. Okay, this is just about ready. I'm going to add some of the dairy, a little bit of milk or cream or half and half. I'm using a little bit of cream to lighten it up and give it that nice round flavor in the mouth. Got a little bit of thyme here. I'm just gonna strip some of it off of here. Sprinkle it on the top. So we got a nice green look to it. And there we go. Nice creamy mushroom soup made with all the wild mushrooms of the season. Recipes from the heart of the home can be found on the Virginia Farm Bureau website at VAFB.com, as well as on Chef Maxwell's website at ChefJohnMaxwell.com.